Hi guys, so I'm back again with another What level are you on spiritually reading? And just before I started this reading, I channeled a song for you. Yeah, and it was... I'm not sure who sings this song, but I've heard it before and it goes... So I'm gonna stand up Take my people with me da, 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 Where I wanna be Yeah, that's all I know. I don't know the rest, but you might know that song. That's what I'm hearing. But I see someone who stands up for, you know, some, some kind of rights. So you could be a feminist, I'm hearing. I also heard the Buddha. So I'm getting, that's who you, yeah, that's who you kind of worship or that's who you follow. That's what I'm hearing. I heard the Buddha and the Bodhisattvas. So I'm getting, you, you, you studied the Buddha. Or maybe you're into Buddhism, you're into the religion, Buddhism. Yeah, but I definitely heard the Bodhisattvas as well. Yeah, so I'm getting, these are the sentient beings that you connect with too. That's what I'm hearing. So you could be doing some living soul work. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah, so I'm going to shuffle some cards and see what's going on. But I feel like whatever you're doing, you did this in past lives too. Yeah, before Christ, I'm hearing. You did some kind of spiritual work in a past life. And that's why, you know, you're still connected to the Buddha and the Bodhisattva. Hearing that too. So I'm going to shuffle some cards. And I'm going to ask the Buddha and Jesus Christ for messages for what level you're on spiritually. Wow, this is amazing Pisces, beautiful. So we're starting with the lover's card and I feel like you're in union with your twin flame, definitely in the 3D spiritual realms and it could be in the physical too because this is, you know, upright. So I feel like you connect with the Buddha and the Bodhisattvas so that they can help you on your life path towards your twin flame. That's what I'm picking up. There's a six in this card, so I'm getting you could be on life path six. You could be Virgo North Node, that's what I'm picking up to with this card. I see that, you know, you're being guided towards your twin flame if you're not in union, but you're definitely in spiritual union. Maybe you're both on Virgo North Node, or maybe you're your um, twin has you know Virgo in their chart yeah because I'm getting whatever um you know who your twin is if um they have the same rising sign like basically your twin has the same rising sign as their first sign, as their sun sign, that's what I'm getting. So you could be twins with a Virgo and you are Virgo rising, that's what I'm getting. Yeah, so you're both on life path six, that's what I'm hearing. I see union in the physical in this card. I see that you're both together. You're happily living together. You could have a happy marriage. I see you building something here. And you've built this through, you know, guidance from your, you know, 
the Buddha or the Bodhisattvas I'm hearing have guided you two together and that's how you came together, that's what I'm hearing. I feel like you're both religious so you could study, you know, Buddhism, Christianity, yeah, and I feel like this led you to the Nine of Pentacles, success, money, growth. I feel like, yeah, you started off, you know, building some kind of life for yourself all by listening to your guides, that's what I'm hearing. And you've become very successful. I see you also have a spirit animal, so you could connect to birds a lot, that's what I'm hearing too. I see a lot of growth that has come from, you know, from you, you've grown spiritually. I see you protected, you have a cloak on here. I feel like you're protected because you've opened, activated and cleansed all your chakras. I feel like nine chakras are open and I feel like you're on the ninth dimension right now, which is a very high dimension but you're heading to the 10th, that's what I'm hearing. You're heading to become an ascended master because you will be grounded. You will be grounded spiritually, physically, you know, mind, body and soul. You'll be grounded and connected to the earth. So you have a lot of earth works to do. And with the sun card, I feel like it's something to do with children and animals that you're you know, supposed to be working th with or you are working with right now. So you could be a teacher, someone who's teaching children, someone who's, you could even be, I'm hearing, someone who teaches children to ride horses. So you could be a horse riding instructor, I'm hearing that too. But I definitely see you working with the children and the animals. I also feel like you, you have telepathy. So you could be connecting with the children and the animals te telepathically. You could be talking to them, you know, and hearing what they're saying through your mind. That's what I'm getting. Because we all know children are innocent and children hear messages telepathically. And that's how animals communicate too, by telepathy with each other. So I'm getting, you have this gift you have this gift where you can hear what a child's saying before they've even said it you know what they need you know what they want you know how to help them i see you standing up for the rights of children but also standing up for the rights of animals too so you could be a feminist who's you know who protests i'm getting who protests for children and animals that's what i'm getting also earth you're the kind of person who protests against, you know, hurting animals, hurting plants or, you know, destroying the environment. You could be into, you know, like pollution and all of that, like helping the earth. That's what I'm getting to. So you do a lot of spiritual work. That's what I'm picking up. And the wheel of fortune coming into your life is luck, nothing but luck. And it's all guided by the Buddha, by the Bodhisattvas, by Jesus Christ. That's what I'm getting. You're guided divinely. And so is your twin. That's what I'm hearing. <clears throat> you could both work together spiritually and physically to you know to help these animals to help these children to help the earth that's what i'm seeing yeah so we've got another six here six of swords so you're definitely on life path six I feel like you you do a lot of traveling, so you could be astral traveling to help these animals and children. Yeah, you could do it at night too, that's what I'm hearing. I see you both working as a team to help heal children, to help heal animals. I see you traveling overseas to do this job too, to go and protest against, you know, 
women's rights, animal rights, you know, the earth's rights, I'm hearing that too. Children's rights as well. More messages, please. Any more messages, please? Thank you. Yeah, so... I'll see you here. You're going to get a lot of money from this work that you're doing. And the money is going to, you know, to help others. That's what I'm hearing. So the money you're raising is not for you. I feel like you raise a lot of money to help other people. That's what I'm picking up to. Yeah, with the emperor in reverse too. I feel like... Yeah, children who have been abused, neglected, you know, abandoned by fathers. You know, you're standing up for the rights of the female too. That's what I'm getting. Females who have been treated badly by men, who have been wronged, who have been, you know, hurt. That's what I'm getting as well. Yeah, so I've got the Three of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. So you're definitely teaching. So you're helping people and teaching them the right way. That's what I'm getting. And you're the Queen of Wands. So you're very caring. You care about standing up for people's rights. And I heard that in the song. Because the song's called Stand Up, I'm sure. So I feel like, yeah... You stand up for women's rights. You're standing up for the rights of the earth. You're standing up for the animals, standing up for the children. And you're going to teach people the correct path. That's what I'm hearing. Because you know, you have the inner knowing. You've done the soul work. You, your crown chakras lit. You receive what you need from the Buddha, from the Bodhisattvas, from Jesus, and you follow your orders. I see you here watching and following every order that you receive, and you're on the right path. You're standing in your power right now, and I see nothing but growth and abundance heading towards you for all the work you've done. You're protected too. I see a lot of cloaks protecting you. You're divinely protected, divinely guided, and you have spirit animals working closely with you because you've helped them so much. You're surrounded by a lot of angels and animals. That's what I'm hearing. And you're doing the right thing. So well done, Pisces. You're on high levels right now. You're fully grounded in spirituality. And this is your reading, so I hope this helps you. So don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe.